Day 23. Martin is apparently still alive. I did bring some meds. Meds for everybody. We've been raided. Yeah. They really meant business, but they didn't do much harm. Too bad we had no weapons. Martin was wounded, but the attackers didn't steal anything. Oh, she's exhausted and sad. Well, you can eat. Martin, what's wrong with you, mates? Slightly wounded and recovering. For fuck's sake. Do we just need to give him so many meds? Hop him up on meds. Feed him. Bloody hell. Martin is just a whipping boy. If this in this entire campaign. Nobody's been so hurt as Martin. I know Pavle got a bloody hiding from Bruno, but... Uh... Okay, what's Martin doing? Feel better now? Alright, well, take your meds too, mates. Kachi, you can cook, actually. It's probably good for food. Nothing. We need water. More water. More bloody wa Oh, that's gonna take forever. Alright, she's gonna have to sleep. Alright, well, we got anything else to cut to pieces in here? We got a spare bed, I guess, we can, we can knock apart. Well, that's not good. Well, look, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bash that bed to pieces. His favorite bed, I'm gonna, I'm gonna knock it to pieces. I feel like we need some fuel. I did, I, I left too much behind in the church, I gotta admit. I left way too much behind. That water's taking a long body time. Is that, oh, that's why it's taking a long body time. It's not finished. Oh, for feck's sake. I could've had water by now. Look, let that be a lesson to you, kids. Never leave your water filters in serial killers' apartments unchecked. When will this bloody war end? That's what I want to know. It's already been going on far longer than this game is set. Months or years, apparently. So it feels like each day here is, is much longer. It says day one, two, three, but I, it feels like it's longer. The temperature has changed really wildly since we've started. And people are taking hours to get to the top of the apartments here, so... Oh, look at that. We didn't bloody outfit it properly. I'm not sure why I ever stopped. Alright, well, that's, that's gonna take a while still, unfortunately. Oh, we got some herbs. We'll send Martin onto that. Okay, he's bandaged and he's on meds. Right, right, right. Great. You'd gladly eat something, will you now, mate? At least he's not depressed. He hasn't been on a wild killing spree yet. We really are going to have to have Kancho sleep, just completely sleep. Okay, so broken is the limit of being depressed. Exhausted is the limit of being tired. We have, I don't think we've pushed anybody to the limit of being hungry. I think very hungry or starving. I guess death would be the next step. Oh, we can make him a cigarette. Well, what can we do with these other herbs though? Oh, raw herbs. We've just got tobacco here. All right, mate. Well, keep yourself busy. Somebody's a smoker. Beautiful. At, at very minimum, we'll have something to trade. So, we will... I guess we'll knock down the bloody bed next. He doesn't really need to sleep, we just need that water to come through. And it'll be there eventually. I know it's getting... Oh, well, look, we'll throw on the heater. We'll double the temperature with one stick of fuel. We got a couple of books. I don't think we threw him out. I hope we didn't. But, um... I think after that... My, my priority at the moment is kind of to, uh, to get that food going. It's all just, at the moment, it's kind of like a race to night time. Like, nobody seems to be in any real danger. I mean, Kach is exhausted, but that's because Martin was so bloody sick. I expected him to recover. Don't mind me, Katja, just casually cutting this fucking bed to pieces. Oh, we didn't get any fuel from it. Damn, that annoys me. That really annoys me. Oh, well. Let's go and make, um... Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, mate, we should have water by now. We do. Wait, no, we don't. Oh, we need fuel. Cool. That, that I can do. That I can do with... A book that apparently no fucker is reading. So what do we need? We need two fuel for this? One. Alright, so that's more efficient that way. We got plenty of time to do both. 
Oh, let's make another stick of fuel. Uh, let's make food before we do that. I know we should think about heating, man. I know. I should go check what that actually requires. I'd, li I'd like to have food on standby here in the kitchen. It doesn't get stolen. And nobody's gonna stay up again. There's no fucking way. What does this require? Improved heater. Requires thermoregulate. Oh, we can actually just go build that right now. Let's go do it. Why not? If we can, we can. I think it requires this. Let's just go check it out. I'm bleeding just a little. Well, sorry, mate. I'm actually gonna have to send you out. The scavenger. We're gonna have to send into a scavengy place, not really a tradey place. Yeah, what's a thermoregulator take? Oh, we can't actually make it. Fuck it, let's go. He's not gonna make it though. That'll be half complete. I guess that why it was that was why the water was frozen. What the filter? The night. Uh, while he works in the background, apparently, so we'll send him out. I don't know where else to send him, to be honest. Construction site. Danger, of course it's danger. It was supposed to be a luxurious residential area, and there was a great hype on apartments there. But the developers fled abroad when the war started. Recently, the military wrested control over this area from the rebels. We could scavenge whatever the rebels left behind, but there is a risk of encountering, encountering military patrols. Man, look, I don't know. They say there's danger. Semi-detached house. Visited two days ago. What did- what was the problem there? Oh, they got annoyed. When I went there, that was the problem. Well, I'm gonna go check out the construction site. I don't know it says danger. Did it say possible danger for other places, or...? Caution advice. Supermarket. The supermarket is located in the area remaining under military control, but people are still trying to scavenge it for supplies. Perfect. Trade will be approximately zero. I might actually take Moonshine just in case. I don't... Yeah, look, I don't know. I'm not really in the mood for trading. But just in case there is a trader there, I got the Moonshine. To get anything, just to convert it to box parts, maybe. Alright. Igor, you take the upstairs on the roof. Shit, like straight up, there's there's people bugging me. Can I just talk? Can I just talk to him? Hey you, hey. Should be enough for both of us, don't worry. Oh, thank god for that. Okay, so I just I won't move quickly, I won't steal, and maybe you won't fuck with me. Okay. Oh. Somebody's busy with that. Cool. Alright, so everybody's scavenging. Herbs, weapon parts, let's go. I'm so glad he didn't want to shoot me. Three dudes with AKs and I've got a hatchet. Like, I'm feeling pretty... Pretty outgunned here. Somewhat literally. The last thing we did... Like, it, it should... By rights... He shouldn't survive this. Like, according to everything else. Okay, that was why it was caution advised and not just danger. Oh, somebody's shopping cart. I don't have enough money, I'll be back soon. And then I leave a trolley full of uh, ice cream behind for you to uh, put back on the shelf. Okay, so we don't really need the fertilizer now, those are more important to us, that's cool. Oh, phew. Let's just case this place. This case, this case, this place goes for a while. It's a warehouse at the back, not sure what the deal with that is. Oh man, sugar. Water will take water. At the moment, I think I'd more, I'd rather more veggies. I'm not sure the cigarettes will be useful to us. And I'm also gonna like try and avoid these guys and go straight at the back of the warehouse. I'm not sure they'll come in handy either. I don't mind either. Oh, we can actually open that. Okay, cool. Is he gonna get mad? Well, I can't actually leave from here, which is kind of annoying. If he corners me, I'm boned. Holy shit. Water, electronic parts, canned food would have been alright, but... Shit happens, I guess. Nice bloody automatic, gunf automatic gunfire. Just casually walk past him, he'll be fine. 
Let's go upstairs, see what happens. See what, see what somebody says. Is he gonna be mad? Say, hey you? I got my eye on you. Alright, mate, he's alright. Phew, he's alright. So at the moment we get to pick and choose. There is actually a lot of, lot of stuff here. We just can't be jerks. Uh, today we can't be jerks. I don't know if we can come back and they're, they're rude, but... Uh, this is doing some weird scrolling stuff today. I'm not really sure what's going on with it. Two squares of sugar. Well, we don't really need the sugar too badly. Let's see what they left behind here. Oh, we can't get through there either. We might have to just book it after this. You don't want to cause trouble here, friends. Well, look, I'm going to leave some stuff behind because I really want that, uh, that morsel of food. Well, let's go down. And no sudden movements, Martin. What are you doing, mate? No sudden movements. You're making everyone nervous. Oh, shit. Speaking of sudden movements, scaring the shit out of people. I, uh, I might go up here because I haven't checked it out yet. Is he going to be annoyed too? Maybe. Can't see the name in the supermarket. There. Shell casings. We can actually make bullets at this stage. I might, I might just do that. Because we can. Don't mess. I don't want to mess, man. I just want to check out this stuff on the ground. Coffee and a morsel of food. That we will take. And now we'll run to exit. That hasn't been a bad night. We're definitely coming back here. Um, with Kaji, who's got a couple more backpack slots and no shovel. Marin is back.